cabbage farmers in some parts of the Ashanti region are experiencing low yields and income levels due to the insect and disease attacks on their farms. The diamondback moth insects and leaf blight disease are destroying cabbage crops in the Amenti Central and Bosome Freho districts. Today on the food chain, Prince Apia visits affected farms and speaks to interest groups on interventions. Farmer Jemfi walks through his one and a half acre of cabbage farm with despair. He has lost every crop on this land. Cultivated almost five months ago, Jemfi and his brother were hopeful their 5,000 CD investment in this vegetable farm will yield enough to cater for their family. It's all here cabbage, you food here, the way you are. Their farm it's one of the many farms infested with diamond back moth insects and leaf blight disease. The leaf blight disease turned the green cabbage leaves from green to yellow, then brown, and ultimately reducing the suitability of the cabbage head as food. The diamond back moth attacked the cabbage head, affecting the growth, yield, and marketability of the crop. Jeffy and his brother want support. The threat and pain for yeah, the way we are seeing now say, and no, and the beer and also yet to be an idea. I buy a down Roma, sister or the brain, and no abbey, and yes, you are toy, yeah, a dear human, and so a dear humble. A ma, you need that so say, and no abbey soon, yes, you are the better to be an eddy, and Timmy Coyer, the amount for an enamel or more yen. The Amancia Central and Bosome Freon District, known for their significant vegetable production are the hardest hit in the cabbage infestation. Yabua Isiyama is agricultural director for Amansia Central District. When we come to Amansia Central District, Heman, where we are now, is noted for vegetable production. And uh, every year we have a working document which we work towards it. And that's the work plan. In last year's deliberation, it came out that in my, the cabbage farmers here are facing a lot of challenges with respect to pest attack and that of a disease. So we noted it down and sent the report to the region. So the region also contacted research, that's called Research Institute, and then they decided to come and then work on it. Over the years, most farmers have desperately been using different agrochemicals and combinations of insecticides and fungicides to control the pest and disease, but the pests have shown resistance. Scientists at the Crop Research Institute of the Council for Scientific and Industrial Research have started research extension farmer trial in the affected areas. Supported by extension officers from the Department of Agriculture, the intervention is under the Government Modernization Agriculture Program. Dr. Ernest Berfi is the focal person for modernizing agriculture in Ghana project. Cabbage growing areas reported constraints with fungi diseases and pest infestation. And so through the REC program, we go to the research, Crop Research Institute, to help us find solutions to these challenges that are facing farmers. And the Amancia Central, when we first went, the challenge was with the blight disease as far as other pest infestation. However, there is a peculiar issue with the Bosome Frehon district where we are now. They also complained that 
they appear to be resistance build up in the pest and so it became critical that apart from finding remedy for the disease and the pest here there was also the need to find a way to manage the pest resistance builds up that is in the district the three-month verification trial by the researchers exposed the best pest and disease management Dr. Blankson Wadiamwabeng as lead researcher what we decided to do was to uh, conduct or establish a small demonstration uh, and uh, come with six insecticides and three fungicides. So uh, we came and we established the trial and fortunately almost all the insecticides uh, performed uh, excellently. Yeah, so at least for now we know we have achieved our results. A number of insecticides and fungicides were assessed in the laboratory for their bioefficacy against the diamond back moth and cabbage leaf blight, respectively. Jemfi and other affected farmers are excited at the research outcomes but want the result disseminated as soon as possible. Scientists are therefore selecting the best bio and synthetic insecticides for onward dissemination to farmers. Prince Apia reporting.